What is a financial system? A financial setup may be a network of economic institutions like insurance companies, stock exchanges, and investment banks that job together to exchange and transfer capital from one place to a different. Through the economic system, investors receive capital to fund projects and receive a return on their investments. Understanding financial systems, financial markets involve various players, including borrowers, lenders, and investors that negotiate loans for investment purposes. The borrowers and lenders tend to trade money in exchange for a return on the investment at some future date. Derivative instruments also are traded within the financial markets yet, which are contracts that are determined supported in underlying assets performance. When determining the rules of raising capital within a financial setup, the project being funded and who funds them are decided upon by the planner, who may be a business manager. Thus, the financial setup is usually organized through central planning, economy, or a mixture of both. A centrally planned economy is structured around a central authority, like a government, which makes economic decisions regarding the manufacturing and distribution of products for a selected country. A laissez fair economy is when the pricing of products and services is dictated by the aggregated decision of citizens and business owners, often leading to the results of supply and demand. Financial markets operate within a government regulatory framework that filters the type of transactions that may be conducted. Financial systems are heavily regulated thanks to their influence and facilitation capabilities to contribute to the expansion of real assets. Financial system components. The financial setup consists of the many components counting on the amount. From a company's perspective, its national economy includes procedures that follow its financial activities. It includes aspects like finances, accounting, revenue, expenses, wages, and more. From a regional standpoint, the economic system, as mentioned above, facilitates the exchange of funds between borrowers and lenders. Players on a regional level would come with banks and other financial institutions like clearing houses. On a world scale, the financial setup includes the interactions between financial institutions, investors, central banks, government authorities, the Globe Bank, and more. 1. The Savings Function As already stated, public savings find their way into the hands of these in production through the economic system. Financial claims are issued within the money and capital markets, which promise future income flows. The funds, within the hands of the producers, leading to the assembly of higher goods and services and a rise in society's living standards. When savings flow decline, however, the expansion of investment and living standards begins to fall. 2. Liquidity Function Money within the style of deposits offers the smallest amount risk of all financial instruments, but its value mostly eroded by inflation. That's why one always prefers to store funds in financial instruments like stocks, bonds, debentures, etc. However, in such investments, I, a greater level of risk is involved, I, and also the degree of liquidity, I, conversion of the claims into money is a smaller amount. The financial markets provide the investor with the chance to liquidate the investments. 3. Payment Function The financial systems offer awfully convenient mode of payment for goods and services. The check system, MasterCard systems at all are the simplest methods of payment within the economy. They also drastically reduce the value and rhyme of transactions. 4. Risk Function The financial markets provide protection against life, health, and income risks. These are accomplished through the sale of life, health, and property insurance policies. Overall, they supply immense opportunities for the investor to hedge himself thurself against or reduce the possible risk involved in various instruments. 5. Policy Function Most governments intervene within the financial setup to influence macroeconomic variables like interest rates or inflation. As an example, the federal bank or a financial organization does likes several cuts in CRR and take a look at to force the interest rates down and increase the supply of credit at cheaper rates to the corporates.